here we go, here we go. Tom Pelissero, literally under a minute ago, is reporting the new contract numbers, the financial details of the Aaron Rodgers re re rework deal. Okay, this was massive. Of course, we got the news <clears throat> uh, late last night, I think around like 11, from Mike Florio, basically just saying that there was a restructured deal agreed upon. It wasn't official. We didn't know the numbers. Um, nothing was signed. It was just agreed to in principle. Uh, so Aaron addressed it, of course, after practice and said, yes, it's done. Uh, and it will become official like later on in the day. Tom Peller said... <laughs> Tom Pelissero is hitting us with the numbers now. He said the Jets signed four-time NFL MVP Aaron Rodgers to a new two-year contract worth $75 million guaranteed through the 2024 season per NFL salary data. Rodgers had nearly $110 million guaranteed remaining on his old deal with Green Bay. He's taking less for a shot at a ring or two in New York. He then goes on to say Aaron Rodgers' new contract is technically a five-year deal, including two option years to spread out the bonus proration and create a 2023 cap number of just under $9 million. That's crazy. Maximum flexibility for the Jets to build around him. This is absolutely huge. Not only did we just get the numbers, right, finally figure this out, but Aaron Rodgers is taking a pay cut. This was one of the questions that you know a lot of Jets fans were kind of thinking about going into Florio's report yesterday, which was, yeah, there was a lot of, just a, naturally speaking, a lot of questions uh, to be had, right? Will Rogers push a ton of the money into the future? Uh, how much of it will he, you know, uh, essentially give back to the Jets? Like how much, how much of a pay cut will he take? Will he even take one at all? Um, what's his cap it going to be for this season? What's it going to be for next season? As we all know, he was owed over a hundred million dollars next season and man we, we we got the information this is absolutely huge news okay uh number one it of course it's good for the books right more flexibility for the new york jets but i'll say this it's i i, I was almost like i almost couldn't even read the words to be honest with you let me just scroll back up to this tweet here and just reading that first line from pelicero the jets signed four-time nfl mvp aaron Rodgers to a new two-year deal worth 75 million dollars guaranteed just seeing that is still mind-blowing right just seeing like the pictures of aaron thrown in practice and you know him doing press conferences like it's like i cannot believe that we are you know sitting here on the doorstep of um you know, knocking on the door of, of, of the NFL regular season and Aaron Rodgers is the Jets quarterback. Like, you would have asked me that five years ago. I would have said, no, you're crazy. Like, absolutely not. Like, it's not happening. But here we are. Um, so, cap hit just under $9 million for this year. What does that mean? Originally, the Jets had around 22 to $24 million in space, uh, with Rodgers technically getting just over $1 million. So, of course, that cap number is coming down, but uh, it's a lot better than what the um, you know, rumor numbers were going to be, which was upwards of 20 plus, uh, where you're looking at the majority of that cap room now being delegated to A-Rod. So huge if the Jets want to make more moves, maybe more tackle depth. As we all know, Mekhi Bec uh, Becton didn't practice today. Dwayne Brown isn't practicing. Uh, more help on the offensive line. We'll see. Dalvin Cook, that's another whole thing. So we'll see what happens. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comment section. Thanks so much. Go Jets.